I have a question. Yes. Hi, Angela. This is uh, Pradyut Manikya, Chairman of the Tipraha Indigenous Progressive Regional Alliance from India, Tripura, a small political party. And uh, since you spoke about your relation uh, with the similarities between India and uh, Britain during the Second World War, we uh, fought in the Eastern Theatre uh, in the northeast of India with shoulder to shoulder with the British uh, to stop the invading Japanese forces. I'm wondering, uh, since you're from Stockport and you're from a smaller, uh, you're not from London, Greater London, so we also come from a region which is slightly away from the national uh, debate or the spotlight. So I'm wondering, would it make sense if uh, a group of MPs, irrespective of parties, made a visit not only to New Delhi or Bombay or Bangalore, but also took a detour and visited uh, Northeast, uh, our state of Tripura, Nagaland, uh, Manipur, and also probably even looked beyond that because uh, the entire Eastern Theatre, the, the entire connectivity, uh, the Stillwell Road, which was built by General Stillwell, is still there, which connects us to the entire Far East and ASEAN countries. Also looking at new opportunities, would it make sense if you all made a visit and put that in your agenda? I think uh, the government of India would welcome you as well, and I think even the state governments across the region would probably welcome you. Would, it, would that be in your uh, uh, outlook as well in the plan? I think, I think that's a really important point. And in, in the UK, actually, we've had devolution. We started off with Scotland. It's got their own parliament and powers now. We've got Welk, the Welsh government that have devolution and their own powers and their power and they implement things differently. And in the England now, we've got Metro Mayor. So I talked about our Greater Manchester Mayor, Andy Burnham, and he's got devolved powers. We've got West Yorkshire Mayor, who's just devolved and franchises the buses, and they've got much more control at a local level now. So I think it's really important that, that we have events and we link up at a much more regional and sub-regional level because our economies are different. Your economy is different where you are compared to New Delhi. You know, the, it's, it's completely different around how things operate and how those links can work. So I think there is something, there is a push in the UK politics at the moment because they think that Westminster politics has failed them. You know, there's been a frustration, shall we say, from our population around Westminster politics. And there is a much more sort of push towards localism and about making sure that our regional economies can do well. So I actually think there's something very positive about what you're saying as an invite and we'll definitely be in touch. But there is, there is something very positive about reaching out beyond the national politics or even political parties and going right down to the local level, speaking to our metro mayors, speaking to our politicians, whether that's in the Scottish Parliament, whether that's in the Welsh Parliament, because they have their own governments there as well, or whether that's within our regional structures as well. And you'll find that there is a diversity and powers and levers that can bring those relationships more closer together without the bureaucracy that you may find when you're trying to do it from a central spot downwards. And I think there is a definite push in the UK towards that. Our electorate want more control and power at source where they're at because they, what's happening in Sheffield is completely different to what's happening in London. Their way of life is completely different and one size does not fit all. And the UK have recognised that. And I think that will become more of a thing in the UK. I don't think even if the Westminster politics wanted to if I became Deputy Prime Minister and wanted to hold everything centrally in a year or two's time, I don't think that would happen because I think that the push is the opposite way. So any politician in the UK that doesn't recognise that I think would be at their peril. I think the, the um, fashion, the, the mode of transport, the, the direction in which we're going at the moment is towards more regional devolution. So I think those links that we could make are actually very crucial to make them at local levels as well.